growth. What you get in life is a direct result of how much you're spending your time on your growth. Yes, as transgender people or as people who identify as cross-dressers, it is very critical for us to invest time and effort in our own personal growth. Why? Because you know out there the whole world judges you. The moment you step out and you know show yourself the way you want to show yourself, people start judging you. And it is not because they really want to hurt you, but it's just because you know that's how majority of the people are conditioned to see you. That is how majority of the society is programmed to look at you. So if you really want to go out there and be yourself, you have to invest a lot of time and effort on your personal growth. Now what do I mean by personal growth? There are two things which I will be covering in this video which will ensure that you are not only able to express yourself the way you want but also are growing as an individual. The first thing that you have to work on and this is something I keep talking about you know, to all my clients as well. You have to work on your personality. You need to know how you have to present yourself in front of the world. You need to work on your personality in such a way that you project yourself as a confident person. Now, what does this personality include? It could be your you know, voice, it could be your communication skills, how you talk to people, you know, your, how efficiently you talk to people. It could be your uh, makeup, the way you do your makeup. You don't have to be an expert, but you need to know basics of makeup. Or it could be, you know, your, your sense of fashion, whichever way, you know, you want to present, present yourself as a girl. You need to have some kind of an, you know, knowledge on that. Then comes your non-verbal communication. Things like, you know, how you sit, how you walk, how you treat people, your, your, your body language and all of that. And when you combine these, you know, these skills, your overall personality emerges as a very beautiful and a confident person and trust me if you come across as a you know confident person people will treat you nicely people will support you because they see the effort that goes behind it the second thing that you also must work on is to be financially independent this is so critical for your growth in life especially if you are someone who is a cross-dresser or a transgender person why because if you look at the history of our society there was a time probably you know 30 40 years ago where women were really suppressed in the society they were not allowed to go out and work but that has changed women started going out and challenge challenging the you know social norms initially it was very tough for them also to come out in the open and you know do things which they were not supposed to do but they challenged the traditional norms and today women are considered equal in society as compared to men now where do you think we are you know, as, as people who belong to the LGBT community or the you know trans community, where do you think we are? We are pretty much facing the same thing that women have faced for centuries. We are facing that suppression, especially in a country like India. So we have to come up. And the best way to come up in society is to work on your career, is to work on your finances, is to build enough money and wealth in your career and in your life so that you can confidently go out there and you know face the world money helps having enough money in your bank account helps so whatever your career is maybe you're you know a doctor a lawyer an engineer or a businessman whatever it is that you do especially if you are a cross-dresser or a transgender person you have to keep improving keep growing and you all know this 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 is expensive girls 
this this requires money initially when you're starting out you have your male wardrobe and you start building your female wardrobe that itself requires so much expenses forget the mistakes and you know what to buy and what not to buy that comes later but you need a lot of you it's like you know it's like you have you have to build a wardrobe for two people and all this will require a lot of money so focus on your career i get a lot of messages on social media where you know people are so young and they are they are just focused on having fun and you know they are in the closet and they are trapped but they just want to have fun dress up and not tell anybody they don't realize where they where this is taking them you know 10 years down the line or 15 years down the line you have to focus on your career girls and this is the best time to focus on your career because today there are so many opportunities for anybody which were not there probably you know 15 20 years ago so go out there and build yourself in such a way that you are healthy you are wealthy and you have a personality that nobody can match i hope you are able to learn from this video i hope you are able to implement some of these changes and start focusing on some of these things in your life and trust me if you can build the personality that you want and you can grow in your career at the same time you will reach a place where nobody can touch you i hope you reach there soon this is me annie rose signing off from this video and i will come up with more videos on many topics to help you build confidence to help you build your feminine self and face the world like a fearless diva take care